Calabash Alley, a street in my country, reflections of my society. Galvanized peeping is an everyday thing. Who ain't see does say they see. Calabash Alley is all a we. Calabash Alley, where marbles are pitting. Hundred hole and cack for Boki. Gossip and cussing is really no big thing. Youths pelting green mango at mango tree. Calabash Alley is all a Calabash Ali, a natural kind of bacchanal, running jockey in the canal. We listen to the calypso, we just prefer, we like it so. Calabash Ali is the place to be. Calabash Alley is the place to be. <laughs> hey, hey, Shirley, what happened? Where you going with that big grip? Miss Mabel. Huh? Like you leaving your man? You will know in time. But at least tell me something, darling. I have nothing to tell you or do with you. But look at my crosses. Oh, guy, you ever see anything so? Like she leave, Danny. Maybe I'll go and find out what happened now. When you see fellas vex, it's better to leave them in peace, let it cool off. Me and Danny attacked me and beat me upside down. But you seen how you could defend yourself, and you was bragging how you could fight up with anybody? Yes, sweet. I could fight any woman, but you expect me to tangle up with a man. At least not in fighting. But did she leave him? Danny have no worries. He black and beautiful and could get any woman he want. Well, I jump in line and shake my body line. <laughs> <laughs> Mabel, you feel Danny could take on a big fat mama like you? <laughs> but look at you. I is a good soft mattress for any man. And I got personality and charm. And I could get any fella I want. <laughs> it's true. The kind of fella who will put a bag over your face when making love to you. <laughs> All God. I find it giving him mouth a lot of liberty these days. <laughs> but you could come in the yard, tin for Tina. She went to shop, my dear. When she reached up by here, I will bust on one scandalous laugh to provoke she. I go in. I don't want no bacchanal. Wait now, Olga. You see how she walking and whining up she says? She too cost scared. It's ridiculous. Olga, don't go yet. Since I do talk to she, tell she what happened between Danny and Shirley. But nothing happened yet. Tell she how they mash up. At least it, it looks so. Good afternoon, Tina. Like you went to shop? Yes, my child. I went to the mall to buy some material for a wedding I has to attend on Sunday. Oh, oh. you hear how Shirley leave Danny? I'm not surprised at all. She could not make him happy. And furthermore, surely too decent for some of the people living in Calabash Alley. He closed up since she gone. And since you and he used to do kind of good before, surely come and live with him. Try and talk to him now. Sorry, my child. I just keep myself very much to myself. And I don't trouble trouble until trouble trouble me. I go see you. All right. Them seamen she with the street, she real good. Long time. She got her only shop on George Street or Charlotte Street for the food. I didn't mind to cuss you off when she say how surely to descend for some of the people living in the alley. She was dropping words for me. Maybe I'll, I have to go now. My husband Ralph coming home for lunch and I don't want him find me gossiping in the yard. We go pick up.
You surprise me when you run and ask me to pick you up. You change your mind rather quickly. I must admit you were right all the time. I was prepared to accept Daniel, but if you don't want to see him again, it's entirely up to you. As I said this morning, your life is yours to live, and you must be able to do what you want with it. Only now I realize, after nearly 50 years of living, that a man should do what his heart tells him. I don't know what to do. I just feel to. Surely. People looking at you, leave the tears for when you reach home. Forget what's in the past and press on with what life has to offer. How do you think mother will be I ran and told her you were coming. She was all excited. Look, she's waiting now for us in the porch. Surely, I'm sorry. Come, let's go inside. Surely, I wanted to come and see you, but I didn't know how Danny King would receive me. I'm glad you didn't come. That place is a jungle. Okay, I'm off to work. But I learn a lot from staying there. Tell me what happened. I'm anxious to hear. Let's sit and talk. I feel like a little girl again. No shoes. At your age. Mommy, let me tell you everything from the beginning. Go right ahead. Remember when I took my grip just before carnival and walk off? Well, Danny was waiting for me at the corner of Orange Blossom Avenue and the main road. We took a taxi together and dropped out in Prince Street and walked to Calabash Alley to his room. One room? Yes. He used to live bachelor there. But I learned from the neighbors that from time to time he would bring girls there. Sometimes they would spend a night or two and then leave. Sometimes one might spend a few months. We played math together and everything was going fine for